Hey, fighting. And we are live. <laughs> hello, hello, guys from all over the world. We are live again, and probably it's going to be strange for you because lately we did our go live in yeah. Bulgarian because our main goal is to help as much Bulgarians as we can to see the beauty of this. Um, platform and but today it's very very special go live because we have very very special guests this is Joanna and Aline from Ottawa the first Romanian coach uh, in our biggest and uh, largest community global uh, uh, largest community in the world so before that Thank you for following our business page. Uh, thank you for all of your support, guys. And as usual, tell us where are you watching us from? Mm, what is the time? You can ask questions if you, you like can ask it. any questions. You can see we can see your questions. So yeah, uh, hi Betty. Hi, lovely couples watching from Niagara Falls. Thanks for watching us. Uh, any question you have in your head, please feel free to to share it with us. By the way, I'm Mira. This is my husband, Sergey, And our guests, one more time, are Joanna and Eileen from Ottawa. And we, we asked them for this interview, guys, because like most of you are Bulgarians, uh, our followers, just to show you people how uh, how successful people from our region can be there people like us there from Ma romania were from bulgaria the same countries we went through the same struggles uh, like uh, immigrants yeah, like uh, and here like immigrants we came here uh, like immigrants we we were struggling back home you know like uh, absolutely the same and we wanted to show you that this is possible uh, because they reached the highest mile, milestone in our business uh, and they're retired. <laughs> they're retired At from... 37, yeah, guys. Yeah. Pay attention about the, the age. They fired them bosses, you know, so... Yeah. And, yeah, one more time, our interview in English will begin uh, now. We're so sorry they they have uh, no idea how to speak Bulgarian. I know some uh, Romanian, by the way, Chanta and Zahar. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm pretty sure you know this word in Bulgarian because they sound the same, but it's not enough to take this interview. Thank you one more time uh, for um, being here on our business page, Ioana and Aline. We are extremely excited and thankful you agree because we know you're very busy with your uh, big team, helping them to... Because, because like we said, this business is not a uh, uh, quick money scheme, you know, like uh, get rich quick and uh, they're going to tell you how busy they are. Yes, here is hard work, guys. We don't uh, uh, <laughs> invite you here just, you know, to uh, to put some money and to lay down and wait. Uh, yeah. This is like, you can try it with the lotto, with Bitcoin or uh, <laughs> something like that. But not, but with, not, not with this. And, business, yeah. yeah, first things first. So, who are Ioana and Aline? Tell us briefly, please. Hi everyone, so thank you again for having us on your page. It's, it's a pleasure to be here and uh, share with you our, our experience. Uh, we are Ioana and Aline, we are originally from Romania. Uh, our first home uh, in Canada, we came in Canada in 2011 and our first home was Toronto. Now we are living in, in Ottawa and uh, we have two beautiful daughters. A little yeah. introduction about, uh, <laughs> about us. Yeah, thank you so much for, for having us here. Um, it's a great pleasure and we are actually happy that we were able to meet in person too. Um, yes, we did that, yeah. And that's the beauty of, uh, of this business actually, you know. We are working online and we meet people uh, through the online space 
but uh, we are also able to take our online life and put it into the offline world. Um, and actually this weekend, uh, we went to Montreal and we've met with, uh, with a few of our uh, business, like business, business partners, partners. Um, from around Montreal. It was incredible, you know, so much uh, good energy and, and excitement. So, yeah. We can imagine. <laughs> awesome, yeah, we saw this. You, you posted some on your page. Uh, so what made you to start uh, uh, your online business? Why, uh, uh, why did you start looking into the online space? Uh, and yeah, and how did you find this uh, business uh, platform? So um, actually, I I decided to start. I was the one looking for an online opportunity uh, because when we moved from Toronto to Ottawa, we went back to exactly the same things. Like you have to go, you have to put your resume out there to find jobs to sell yourself. Um, and we had no no one here in um, in Ottawa to help us out with any anything. So um, it was like taking our life from scratch again. So after after a few months, I told my husband um, I want to start looking for an online opportunity, and he said okay. And <laughs> I I started to look um, in my news feeds on Facebook because I was. Um, aware that the online space is expanding so i was looking for an opportunity it was not just an ad coming popping on my news feeds i was actually looking for for an opportunity and i found um i found an ad and this lady she was talking about you know how you can crack into the online space how you can have your own business so i click on it and i went through exactly the same process that we have today so Three years ago, when I started in 2019, we had the same process. So I register with my name and email address on the website. Um, I watch the webinar, the free webinar. And then from there, it's history, you know. So um, my husband here um, next to me, he was very skeptical. <laughs> yeah, I think I was the perfect uh, skeptical husband because, you know, I was... Uh, I wanted to make sure this business is legit, first of all, and because I know my wife, she, when she's jumping into something, she's she's putting all the heart, and I want to make sure this is legit, and uh, and uh, you know, just just to to make sure everything it's uh, it's okay, and actually she proved me that uh, this business is working, and uh, I saw results on on all this uh, this period, and I joined too <laughs> after one year. Yeah, and, uh, we are together in this business since since then. Yeah, yeah, you know, like it's always something that can happen in your in your life. Like when you when you are a couple, one of the one one of the two people is more skeptical than the other one, and that's normal. And it's okay to be like that because you know, um, you you don't know what the online space can bring you, and there are a lot of things that they are not legit in the online space, and I know that. But as soon as I, I saw the potential of our our business and what we can actually accomplish, where we can get by, like you said, by working towards our dreams, um, I knew that is um, it's gonna help us in the future. So we didn't, um, you know, quit our jobs right away when we found this business. Actually, I um, I got into a job exactly the same time when I started the, the business. And that was just because of him, because he <laughs> told me you have to work and then you do the business at the same time. You know, we are um, European. We like to have a, a stability, stability, something exactly. like a, an income that is coming in your home every single uh, day because we have kids our main why for starting this business actually was our daughters because you know um being home with them um, seeing them growing um that's what we wanted when we actually moved from toronto in toronto we had very good jobs super good paid but we had zero time we were not seeing each other so that was the reason why we moved we moved yeah actually we had weeks when we didn't see each other because I work uh, on nights as a team leader, and by the time I reach home, she was going to work. I would go to work. And, and I said, you know, 
I think we have to push the stop button because you know when the kids came, I think it's time to to uh, spend more time together because this life is too short. And we don't know how short it is, you know. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Absolutely. So. Uh... What actually uh, was your biggest struggle when uh, you started this business? How do you feel like the first Romanian coach in our community, Ioana? And do you have some specific goal like that? I mean, like um, uh, for us being the first Bulgarian coaches, our goal is, as I said, to help more and more Bulgarians to see the beauty of this business and to grab this opportunity because this opportunity is amazing. Everything put together for everyone who wants to start their own online business. What What is the answer for you? So our biggest struggle, uh, my biggest struggle in the beginning and even now is time. Time was my biggest struggle. And that's because, you know, when you start something new, you want to learn, you want to accumulate as much as you want information and our training is very big right now so we have a lot of information there when when i started in 2019 we had like five chapters right now we have like 32 so the beauty of our business is that we we don't fall behind we are always up to date with everything that is happening in the online space we always add value to our training so when I started, I just wanted to, you know, um, learn as much as you, as, as much as I can to go to put in practice and to, to see results. So time I had, you know, we use social media to do everything that we do. We are online marketers, so we use social media. But if you don't um, take in consideration your time, you can scroll on Facebook without even knowing that you are scrolling on Facebook. Even if you are actually looking for things, even if you are actually, you know, you want to find more ideas or you, um, you want to help someone, you, you still scroll. So you can, you can scroll for six hours and actually be zero productive or you can actually time yourself for an hour or two and then see more results. So that, that was my biggest struggle in the beginning. And it's, it's my struggle right now too, because you know when you start to have um, partners in your business and you want to help them out, um, you can split yourself in 200 places in the same time. So I like the one-on-one -on -one connection and um, I'm trying my best to have this one-on-one -on -one connection, but I realized with with time, being with experience, mm -hmm. let's say that that um, it can be impossible when your business starts to grow at the level that you actually want that business to grow. Um, and you were asking about um, becoming the first coach in the community. I um, it was not even a goal for me to be. Uh, the first coach in the community, first Romanian really coach, um, but it is like an honor to be the first Romanian coach, and I'm trying so hard to bring more Romanian um, into this business and become coaches. So I actually have um, someone that is uh, my business partner, and she's Romanian and she's a coach. Um, so the second coach, Romanian yeah, coach, man. and it's incredible to just see that. Um, I was able to help that Romanian coach to become a coach and and like to grow together and to have our businesses connected in a way. Um, and uh, yeah, it's it's you know when you put goals for yourself in this business, you have to be prepared to have success. You know, people start <laughs> normally they start a business and they think about the negative part of it. What if? I'm not going to have success. What if this will not going to work for me? But what if this will work for you? And what if you will have success? You have to prepare yourself mentally to have success in this business because I was able to witness people that have success, had success in this business in a shorter period of time and they were not... Um, they, they were not ready. They didn't know how to behave ha having so much success. Our system works for so many people around the world why not work for you whoever is watching you know so uh, when uh, when i started to 
to discuss with my business partners about be prepared to have success, um, they started to see results just because they started to prepare their mind to become mentors. They started to prepare their mind to become coaches, to become the best version of themselves so they can actually help other people. So, yeah. Yeah, our goal shortly is to create leaders. Exactly. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Right. Successful people. Growing by lifting others. Yeah. Exactly. And you yeah. know, when you um like when you know that you actually need to be um to invest in yourself to be a good leader so you can help other people to become leaders, you um you start to balance your focus. You balance your focus on yourself, on your health, on your well-being, on your, you know, um, uh, your family and business life. You know, you were saying in the beginning that we retired from our from our nine to five job at 37 like last year. Um, yeah, we did that. Right. But it doesn't mean that, you know, I'm not working anymore. People have a, um, a misconception that when people are retiring, they are not doing anything. anything. They just they play, just golf, every play day. golf all day long. Yes, we yeah. like to go and play stuff and to you know travel the Everybody world. Everybody does, yeah. Everyone wants to do that, but in the same time, you need to have a system. You need to have something. You need to have leaders around you that can guide you. You need um, a system that works so you can automate your system as much as you can, semi-automate your system as much as you can. So. Um, you can see the results even if you are traveling, even if you are on vacation, even if you are, you know, um, building your life around your business, not your business around your life. Absolutely. So that's the beauty of um, of a community of people that are helping each other and they lift each other. Amazing. Thank Amazing. you. And yeah. our next, next question is very specific. Uh, we are pretty sure you have what to say about it. What is our next question? Okay, what uh, would you say to our uh, fan sitters? Uh, no, for... first about our fifth stream of income. Yes, our yes, fifth actually. stream of income. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, so, because of our fifth stream of income, we were able to exactly. meet each other exactly. in, person. in person. Absolutely, yes. yes. It was so, um, you know. Every single stream of income that we have in our business, it's related to something and uh, to our community. It's part of our our values, our community values. Um, and I love how uh, they are so well um, put together so we can actually combine them. You know, sometimes people, they say, oh, I want to focus just in one direction. And that's okay. You can focus in one direction. But what if you can actually have a system that has different ways of earning, exactly. different ways of bringing people together? So our fifth stream of income is is traveling the world. Um, and that's incredible that we we have it in our community because being an online entrepreneur, you really want to have the connection the offline connection with with your partners your business partners and by having this fifth stream of income we are actually able to connect in the um offline world more and in the same time to create another stream of income just by doing that so i think it was very um it was a a, a stream of income that came at the right time because everyone had two difficult years. Uh, we were inside of our homes for so long, and now everyone wants to to go out and explore the world and, vacation. and take a vacation <laughs> and and travel. Not just one vacation, maybe two, three, four, if you yeah. have the time to do it. <laughs> so. Um, yeah, I, I really enjoy the, this fifth stream of income. What it's about you? Absolutely amazing. And I think it's a perfect package with what we have right now. Uh, like Joanna said, it's it's the perfect uh, combination and it came at the right time. And it's global. Yeah. And it's global, yeah. We Which, are global. Yeah, the, yeah. all the our... Income yeah. Are, are global and we can actually um, 
make them work together and it's it is um i don't know a life changing it is a life changing when when you can actually see that people are um people are starting to go back to their lives um wi without being as stressed as they were um in the last two years so one question i forgot to put it here as a banner but how do you feel uh, uh, like a retired couple <laughs> <laughs> it's very uh, you're so young and you're already like yeah, 37 and you're already retired yeah but they said congratulations that, actually but they said that you're <laughs> retired doesn't mean uh, like laying on Absolutely. the bed. Our nine to five job. We still we still work in our business. It's it's a very nice feeling because we spend a lot of time together. We drop the kids in the morning. We have breakfast in the morning. Uh, but in the meantime, you still have to be very organized because the time is flying. And okay. if you don't, uh, you, you know, you are not uh, uh, balancing. balancing your your time. Uh, you can spend your entire morning in, in bed, your, you know, yeah. <laughs> or you can spend the entire day doing nothing. And then in the end of the day, you are like, OK, another day just passed by and I didn't do much. So you have to be when you actually work for yourself, your mindset has to change from a mindset of a person who's um, told what to do to a mindset yeah. of a person who needs to do stuff because they know that they will bring results. So um, that was the hardest part, um, not for me, but for Aline. Um, it was very hard to change his mindset. He was even um, after we, we left, he was to like me, waking maybe, up yeah, in the morning. More like, than two months just to, that was my biggest fight. I, I fight with myself to, you know, to break that daily routine and just focus on this specific business because, you know, our uh, society is teaching us to go to school, you know, to mm -hmm. find a job. Yeah. Uh, going vacation once or twice a year, if you are lucky, and that's about it. But we found it in this online business that it's more than that. And uh, the freedom and the, the the time freedom, and I think that's that's the most important part. And uh, you know, yeah. the fact that we were able after you know ten years, a little bit over ten years over in 10 Canada, years. to um, to just take our girls and take our car and and go from Ottawa to Vancouver drive. Exactly. We were um, away. A long run. 15 <laughs> hotels. How many hotels you changed during your 17 hotels. 17, 17 hotels. hotels. So oh 17 God. hotels and different pools and different, you know, places to stay and meeting our partners, business partners. And guess what? All of this, it was a business expense. Yes, it was a vacation for us. But it was a business expense. Yes. We went there for a reason to launch a new product. So it was incredible to actually be able to do that without without thinking about we will not gonna have money to do it. We will not gonna have time to do it. Mm -hmm. We we cannot um, you know come back and pay our bills um, or what's gonna happen with us. Actually, when we came back. We we had in our mailbox um, more than we <laughs> the, the, the expected. New Spain. The new you know, yeah. and that's the beauty of a system that works. Even if you are away, you can bring that to um, a semi-automation, so it can help you on the long run. People are always thinking about short, short term. I want money today or i want money next week but if you think about okay i'm gonna invest money today so i'm gonna have them in a year or i'm gonna have them in two years or you know invest in yourself not just in in the system but in you um so you can grow so you can develop yourself um that's the time when you actually um, start to see long-term results you have a vision you see yourself in a place and like I said, you are ready to have that success because not everyone is ready and you you need to be prepared to actually respond to people because people will always come to you, your very close friends, your family, and they will always ask you, what are you doing? Why you are not working? How come you have money? And even if you try to explain, it is very hard to explain because 
we are like you you are not in the system anymore you are not in You're that not in the- in that to uh, understand uh, uh, label yeah. that everyone has that yeah. is in a job that you have to go how do you make money to don't go to a job from nine to five yes. you can make money but if you don't <laughs> go to a job nine to five jobs you are out of the matrix yeah, yeah, yeah you are exactly. out of the matrix exactly, exactly. <laughs> and and people will always have something to tell you oh now you have money you change you are not you know talking with us anymore oh, yeah. Don't, no, I'm talking with you. It's just that you have sometimes to come to me so we can have a chat. I I can't just be always, you know, me coming to you. But people will always find ways to put you down. It doesn't matter where you are, but you have to be prepared for that. As 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 soon as you start to have success, it doesn't matter if it's online or offline. People will will put you down. Uh, even if they care about you, we'll see you different because they see yeah, you in a different eyes. in a different way. And um, and we learned in in a hard way. We learned to not allow anything negative to come to us and to actually surround ourselves with people that will lift us up and will help us for the long term. And they will um, you know support us in a way. And they're not gonna just bring us down and take all our energy. Um, and I think it's in, in all businesses, um, you have these struggles, let's say, um, and, and you need to work with your mind every single day, read good books, have your, um, you surround know, yourself, surround with, with yourself positive people. and, yeah. and read something that will keep you, um, on the correct line. Uh, because I'm telling you, it's so easy to go back to work. I can find a job right away. It's not about finding a job, you know. I can we both can find jobs right away, but it's and it's so easy. You just go to to the job and you come back home and you do what they are telling you to do and then and that's it. But that limits your exactly. financial, limits your time, it limits your your vision for the future. You have just this specific tiny little space that you can travel. You have this specific time that you can see your kids. Exactly. You know, so um, I'm giving you a very short <laughs> example, and then I'm I'm not gonna talk anymore. Uh, so we, oh, nice. yeah. Keep we, had, we we were home, both of us, of course, and the girls they went to school, and we had like a, a tornado coming. So in the middle of the day, at twelve o'clock, we received a, an email from the school saying that. A tornado will come and we're just going to keep all the kids in the, in, the uh, in the gym. Like all the kids from the school, they will be in the gym. If you want to pick up your kid early from school before the tornado come, um, just come and pick your kid. So I was like, think about parents that are receiving this message and they are at work. And they mm-hmm. can't just take a phone in that second and say, please prep the girls. I will come in two minutes and I will pick them up, you know. And then when we went and we picked them up, Agnes was like, oh, my God, we were so many kids. What (laughs) What happened? happened? We were so many kids in the gym. Like they were saying that something, something, something will come outside. And we were all in the same room. And I'm like, it's okay, mommy. Let's just go home. You know, you have that flexibility of, okay, mommy, I don't want to go today to school because I don't feel like, you know, very well. Okay, mommy, you can stay home with mommy and we can play all day with puzzles. Oh, so cute. Flexibility, yeah. uh, connection yeah. with your with your kids that we didn't have before. My youngest daughter, she asked me, "Mommy, why why my friend is always staying um, in school longer?" And I had to explain her because she doesn't have the luxury of having parents that are um, not working from home or they work m- longer, longer hours. hours. So yeah. kids will stay until six o'clock in in the school after school. So they will have shorter period of time with their parents. And she looked at me and she said, that's not good. And I said, <laughs> yeah. no, no, that's not good. But, you know, some parents, they need to work and that's their job. And they might super love their job. But it is just um, it's a job. A job, yes. It's a job. And you have to balance your job and, you know, the money that you actually spend to keep your kid in the after school. Because I'm 100% sure that the money that you make, they are not worth it. Yeah. The time that you yeah. actually lose with your kids. What What I realize over over all these years that we 
we all have something in common, and this is the power of decision. You decide if you want to go on the left or the right. Yeah. You, you decide if you want to take the job or you want to uh, start your online business or whatever business you want. All your life. <laughs> it's your decision. Yes. yes. Yeah. And, and you know, um, even in this business, when people are starting the business with us as business partners, we always tell them, we can guide you. We are all your, you know, your coaches, your mentors, we guide you. But you are still, I'm giving you the car, but you are still the one who's driving. I can be next to you and I can tell you, go right, go left, go right, go left. But you are the one who who's doing, who's controlling the speed of your time. First of all, if you don't start the car, you're you not going to go anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> you have to start the car first, you know, and then you have to put gas to be able to go with your car to work. So it's always an investment that you need for a business to start, for, um, you know, a car to start. You need you need to invest in in that so um, it can start and then to grow it again you need the right people next to you to guide you um, and I learned in this in this business that um, people that surround you are very important and when you look up to people um, you might realize with time that you actually have people around you that they look up to you. And that's just because you surrounded yourself with the correct people. Um, and in our business, we have so many leaders. And you were there um, at the event to see the the amazing people. And everyone is so regular, exactly. you know. Exactly. No one has anything special. They were not born rich, you know. Um, everyone struggled to get where they are. Um, everyone had two, three jobs. They, uh, most of them, they are immigrants like us. And it's it's just a matter of you know taking that decision for yourself and take the action. You know, and everyone who's watching right now and they are fan sitter, if you are not taking action for yourself, no one will do it for you. Absolutely, no one. You I, are. I would, I would use. Sorry for interrupting. I would use the same example, beautiful example you gave with the car. Yes, you have to start the car, and it's very important to keep driving. Even your speed is very slow. Just keep driving. It's no good if you just drive today, let's say five minutes, then stop for 10 days, and again drive for five minutes. You will hit your goal never. Yeah. Never, ever. Not only when you are on vacation, but <laughs> not with a business. <laughs> with a business, you need to be consistent. It's the same like Absolutely, you know, brushing your yes. teeth. If you want to go to the dentist, you have to brush them every day. Absolutely, yes. Yeah. And please, and let's say hello to our, here is a whole bunch of people yeah. watching us. Uh, uh, we said already. From Niagara Falls, uh, Bediha. Svetla uh, Kasabova from Toronto, Betty, Carolina from, from Spain, this yeah. Chaplin, uh, from... from Vancouver, Svetlana uh, Silianu from G uh, New Jersey, Diana Todorova from London, Elenda Karadia, yes, Koradia. She's, yes, she's, she's Romanian probably? Hi! Or not? She might be. <laughs> Uh, uh, but she, no, she's Cuban. Yeah, I saw. Yeah. Oh, Cuban. Yeah. Okay, I have no idea where she's uh, uh, watching us from, but yeah, Cuban. Ah, yeah. We're global, guys. <laughs> yeah, and, and Dimitar. From yeah. study. Thanks for all of you uh, tuning in today. And the last question, guys, uh, which we think is very important what would you say to our followers? and sensitors which are skeptical which are still thinking which still don't believe in this business uh, and they're shaky they yeah. believe but not exactly yes which they, they you well, know uh, 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 I, I'm, I'm gonna start so you when you <laughs> when when i'm telling you that i was in paris and i i was in a in a bakery and i had the most amazing croissant because they are so good they are delicious and i was just looking at um uh, tour Eiffel and it was amazing i'm just telling you that you can imagine for yourself how that felt for me but you need to go there and experience it for yourself until you don't bite 
from that croissant, you will never gonna know how that croissant tastes. So my advice to people who are watching and they are fan sitters, you have your doubts and that's normal. We had ours too, but you have to bite from that croissant to be able to see if this business actually works for you or doesn't work for you. No one will be able to say that for you. We are um, in this business from different works, from like from different places, from different countries, different ages, um, and the completely different cultures. And we were able to, um, you know, grow together in such a beautiful way. If you really want to do a change in your life, and that's something that it has to come from inside of you, um, it's like you know you have to motivate yourself in a way to be able to to start and to grow something that you you will be proud of. Um, you can have all the motivation from outside, you know, um, we can tell you all these good things that can happen to you, what happened to us, like an example, you know, but if you are not doing it for yourself, you will not going to know the feeling, that feeling that you can have when you bite that croissant for the first time. Amazing. That's a nice example. Very, yes, very, very nice. Yes. Yeah, we have even one Bulgarian proverb saying, uh, one said, uh, <laughs> I know the Bulgarian yogurt is so delicious. And the other person asked, how do you know? And the first one said, I watched through the fence that my neighbor was eating <laughs> and it looks very delicious. <laughs> yeah. Never tried, but... Never yeah. tried. <laughs> yeah. Just try it. Yeah. Just exactly yes uh, uh yes uh, thank you very much for the amazing testimonial guys uh, that was amazing interview and uh, i think uh, our followers took a lot from that you know like that um, uh, just we want to show them that real people are m m getting real re oh. results and yes people like like us we and would just say. to remind you guys for our uh, followers, you know, every Tuesday and Thursday we have live webinars. During this webinar, you can see many people, uh, not many, but five, six people usually, different people every week, every Tuesday and Thursday. They're sharing their experience in our business. This is actually introduction to our business. Uh, just go and check it out. Could be for you, could be not. If it's for you, we'll be very happy to uh, be our partners. We will lead you. We will uh, help you. Uh, we'll but... tell you where to drive, left or right. Yeah. I'm going to tell something to, your, to the people that are watching right now. So when you go and you register um, on the website, after you register, you will go to a thank you page. That thank you page, you will have a recording of a webinar, one of our info sessions. So under that webinar on the right side, you have a button saying, if you want to watch this uh, webinar with subtitles, and I know that some people, they like to watch, and we have different subtitles. If you click on that, you will see a webinar where I host, so you you saw me here. Now you have a little taste of of our story. So if you do that, if you if you register and you click on that button, you will see an amazing webinar that I hosted. I had great people sharing their stories from all over the world, and I recommend you to go and 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 watch it. I love sometimes to just go and rewatch that because <laughs> it brings me so much emotion. Yes, right. When I started this business. I was telling Alin, I want to. I want to do a webinar like that and look at me now I'm I'm I was able to host a webinar I will host again and and I love to talk about this opportunity with people because when you you have a business that you are proud of and you you see results because of your work you know and because of of the people that changed your lives too in this business not just your life but other people's life um, it's just the feeling is incredible and we are all here in this life because we want to feel to feel the passion to feel good to feel healthy um, you know to to experience and to to be joyful 
So just just do that. Try it out and see um, and see if I'm right. And you're gonna <laughs> see me on that uh, webinar hosting. <laughs> Thank you, thank you thank so you, thank much. Thank you very much. Uh, we really appreciate your time, as I said, because it's very precious for you, for everyone, actually. This is the only we have on this earth, the time. <laughs> exactly. That's why we always recommend people to be very careful who they spend their time with. It's supposed to be nice people, successful people, positive um uh, people with with good mind uh, mindset, yeah, mindset. And yeah, guys, we wish you all the best. Enjoy the rest of the day. Thank you one more time. Thank you. Thank you for having us. And yeah, you're welcome. It it was our, our pleasure. pleasure. Thank yes. you. Thank you one more time. Enjoy, and we'll see you next time in person. For sure. For sure. For yeah. sure. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great day. Have a great day. You too. You Thank too. you very Thank much. You. Thank you guys. Bye. Thank you. Bye.